The final kind of filter is a slicer and it's this clickable, easy to use filter added right to your sheet. This is especially good when you're using a sheet as a dashboard or as a reporting tool. To add a slicer, you're going to click on data and choose slicer and it's going to add this little tool. You, you can drag it wherever you want it and then to set up the options. If you don't see them, you click the three dots and then edit slicer. You'll first make sure the data range that you want to filter is correct. This is the data that will be filtered out when you select something from the slicer. And then you choose the column from that range that you want to make the rule. For example, if I want to have a filter so I can only look at certain project types, I can choose project type. When I want to use the filter, and anybody who can see this sheet can use this filter, I can click the filter button. And just like other types of filters, filter by values, filter by condition, and it's going to show me that filtered data. The really great thing about slicers is you can add more than one and this makes it a little bit easier for just about anybody to come in here and filter by more than one column. So there you have it, three different ways you can filter your data, either with creating a filter right through here, using filter views to create a saved view of your data that's filtered, or adding slicers to make reporting and dashboards easier.